though we got a parcel in the post today, and I am excited about this. A receiver. Finally. I have been looking forward to getting this. I will finally be able to fly FPV. It's a 5.848 channel AV receiver. I get out. Little dent in the box, but that's okay. Metal case. I was just half expecting a plastic case for some reason, but uh, no. Now, uh, what have we got? We have our antenna, we have the charge cable, and the AV cable. Here we have signal. Yes, jumble of mess. And there it is. Just change these two buttons. Change the channel. So here we have the Eachin Pro DVR Mini Video and Audio Recorder for FPV recording the video feeds from the camera. It's small little box. Seems to come with plenty of cables, so let's check it out. Now what appears to be some form of anti-static ziplock bag. Get out the staples. Right, uh, it only came in an envelope, which is sufficient. So what have we got? QC past. Okay, sticky foam for attaching it somewhere. And that's everything. Alright, so there's two of them. This is a small little box. It's a, it's a light plastic. Three little plastic buttons. Right, so let's figure out where all these cables go before we start attaching it to anything. But I have learned from that mistake. When you get through to okay, three, four, five lots of cables and three connectors. And the ST cards, SD card slot or micro SD. Okay, so this one has four, four, and six. So I assume this would be for your video in or out, depending on what you're connecting it up to. And the same with this. This appears to be all power types. Ground, five volt ground. So I say that one would probably go there. That's the power the the buttons and that. And then here is video in, audio in, audio out, video out. So I think I will use this one for the. No, we won't. We can use this one because it's bigger. So if that one goes in there, video in, that doesn't look right. Out, that'll be the white be ground, black be audio in, so leave that one for the moment. And this only has four, which looks like for battery power. And for connecting 
it to something else. Let's have a wee look at the instructions. Right, so it's a one double side page for the instructions. And all I need on this is just for a video in straight from the receiver. So it's not going on the quad itself. So that's set up. So this is what I need to deal with the ground, plus five, and video in. That should be all I need. So I was looking for a way to power the ASIM Pro DVR because it takes 5 volts and I wanted it to get the video without interrupting the FPV feed. So what I done was I opened up my receiver and I connected the ground to the, the last pin here the video to the one beside it and the 5 volt to there. I checked it with a multimeter and that was uh, giving me 5 volts. Uh, that way then it leaves the two outs free for the monitor or any other anything else I want to set it up to. So let's pair it up. As you can see, it's no signal there at the moment, and there we go. As you'll see here, that's the time remaining on my SD card. Uh, that's just saying there's no sound, there's an SD card in it, and set for videos. So if you just press and hold the menu button, as you can see, we can get in t to it. And there we have, simple as that. 5 volts, video and ground into this center one here. This I'm just using to connect to this just for the, this illustration. And to confirm it without having to, to wear, my, wear the monitor as my box set. Which will take video from here. <laughs> 